let's assemble three, two, one, blast off. You should have your card base. You'll have a layer with stars, a silver layer, a little banner, the blue uh, layer with your sentiment already um, heat embossed on it, the image that you colored. You will also need some foam squares, tear tape and fun foam. You'll also need your tape runner. You have these three little uh, pearls, so you'll also need your tweezers to help set them. So let's go ahead and put aside what we are not gonna use first. So the first thing we'll do is put down the blue layer. And of course, I'm gonna do this with fun foam and tear tape. Hey, my fun foam this time is blue. I've been getting it in different colors since I've been having a hard time getting fun foam in white. And I found that it actually really doesn't matter what color. So I've been just trying to match it a little bit if I'm using a solid cardstock, um, just so it's not as noticeable if somebody happens to look at your card sideways. So go ahead and center this down. The next thing we're gonna add is the star layer, and we will do that with Tape Runner. And I just sort of centered this inside of the fancy edge on the die cut. Real simple. The next thing we'll do is we're gonna add this silver layer, and I did this with uh, foam squares. You can do it with fun foam. Um, but this is a good way to do it with foam squares. You just wanna make sure in the corner, your corners are set. Like you could do it this way, but then these little corners would be floppy, so I just stuck um, a little one on there. It just sort of helps give it stability. Um, you know, I don't like a wonky card, what can I tell you? And this also will fit um, between the fancy pattern on the die cut. Now we can go ahead and add this little banner up on top here. And I did that also with foam squares and you'll see I hit the corners and then a, a big one in the center. Hmm. Next, we're gonna add the image that we colored. The one thing I didn't show you, this circle that I left white on my sample, I did put some glossy accents on there. However, when I went to do this video or when I did the coloring video, my glossy accents is packed. So I couldn't show you how I put it on there. I, I apologize. So this one just won't have it. I This one attaches up onto the silver um, piece, which you did with the foam squares and then also onto the blue. So what I did is you're gonna do foam squares and some tape runner. So your tape runner will go here, the foam squares there, so it all sits up nicely. And I did this sort of at an angle. All right, and then you wanna go ahead and add your pearls. I like to do that with my tweezers, just easy. And I put mine up here on the top. Power of three, always three. I don't know why. Sometimes these are tricky. I think there's glue on my tweezers. All right, and there we have three, two, one, launching the best day ever birthday card. Thanks for joining me. See you for the next card.